Graves' disease is a key autoimmune disorder, primarily targets the thyroid gland, leading to hyperthyroidism. This condition arises from an intriguing interplay of genetic and environmental factors. A notable genetic predisposition exists, especially in individuals with a family history of autoimmune diseases. It predominantly affects individuals between 20 to 50 years of age, with a marked gender disparity favoring women. Recognizing these risk factors aids in early suspicion and diagnosis. Patients often present with classic hyperthyroidism symptoms, heat intolerance, palpitations, and weight loss. Notably, in the elderly, symptoms may be subtle. Physical examination can reveal a goiter and signs of heart failure. Eyes and skin may also show characteristic changes. Diagnosis hinges on a thorough history, physical examination, and crucially, thyroid function tests. The TSH test, followed by free T4 and free T3, is the initial diagnostic approach, with further differentiation achieved through TSH receptor antibody measurement and radioactive iodine uptake scans. Management is multi-pronged, involving symptomatic control, reducing thyroid hormone synthesis, and addressing extrathyroidal manifestations. Options include beta-adrenergic blockers, antithyroid drugs, radioactive iodine therapy, and thyroidectomy, each with specific indications and monitoring requirements. Be vigilant for complications like Graves' orbitopathy and agranulocytosis, especially related to thionamides. An understanding of these complexities is crucial for comprehensive care. Thank you for listening. Stay tuned for more insightful sessions.